Yeah. So I, I, I had a discussion somebody, with, somebody with a friend whether, this morning whether, because I wanted to understand why didn't we go? We were not invited. <laughs> were you invited? No. I didn't get any because call. Because it's a security area. I know, go. but so I had a conversation with a friend in the mining sector to understand that, I mean, if you want to check if a land has been mined on before, do you just take anybody? Can you tell with the eye when you walk onto the land, even if there's been some form of reclamation? He says, no, you need surveyors because they are the ones who will be able to tell if there's been any form of mining on the land. They have their techniques and they know how to do it. So I was just wondering if really, you know, the, the, the presidency wants to prove that whatever was stated in that report is a lie. Can they take surveyors there to test the land and to be sure that nothing of that sort has happened? That's the only way I may believe um, everything that's happening. But if you take we journalists, I don't have any mining background. You can't take me and tell me, go and look uh, on the land and see if I've mined here before. Because there's beautiful greenery all over the place. So if I see that, of course, I'll think that this is, you know, virgin land maybe. And I wouldn't think that there's probably a hole beneath where I'm standing. So I thought that they would have at least gone beyond that. If they've done that as well, would like to know what the report is on that. But when I saw just the journalist, I was like, hmm, I'm not sure about this. Well, and I think I'm that... Sure. Um, colleagues or who i mean were tempted to say that and i've been here i didn't see anything and it's three years before the incident or after the incident you know so um i don't know i i don't think mm. i i i take professor frimpon buatin's words as sacrosanct mm. because for him to say that we i had to be called to dispatch is it a, yeah, the, a, the a, is it a bulldozer excavator a, excavator one of those things yes to go and repair yeah reclaim or repair yeah I mean, he couldn't have made those statements out of the blue because he said, I took an action and I reported this. No mm. action was taken. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's by inference, my interpretation or paraphrasing that content what that he put out in that 36-page document. Mm -hmm. 36 pages because of the top, the, top the, 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 first, yeah. the first one and subsequent yeah. one. So, so um, I, I think that the government is trying too hard to rub... Uh, on positively and and do in the name of Professor Fem Pombwatin. And I and I think that is you know sometimes you put out too much defense, mm -hmm. it creates a certain negative perception that you have something to hide. You know. And taking journalists to a, 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 a security place and trying for them to do narrations. I, it's not like the normal Pra River or the Galamse areas yeah. where we have dark up pits, yeah. the water is creamy mm. or creamy dark, mm -hmm. where you can make those interpretations. This place is well covered. Mm -hmm. It's how many years after the incident? Three you know. Mm. So I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I would say that I, I was hoping that instead of just taking journalists, unless these journalists have some mining background, but even that, there are people with specialties in some of these fields take a surveyor to do his job. Then if he comes out with a report and says that we have tested, we have seen whatever it is we had to see, we've done whatever checks we had to do, yeah. and this land has never been mined on before, then we know that, okay, maybe we should take, um, you know, what the professor said, you know, with a grain of salt or something. I don't know, but journalists just going there to go and look on bare land. <laughs> yeah. If so, I go and I see grass, I'll say, of course, <laughs> nothing so, has happened here before. Yeah, so my friend Moses said, why didn't we go and cover? But, but I, I think the reality is that the, the former minister, uh, according to um, those who are defending government, say mm. that he, he was livid that he was not given another role. And he wrote this as a justification um, to impress hmm. maybe the presidency or the president so that he'll be given another role after the first term. Oh, you mean the reports that were sent? Yes. But, 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 I, but I, I don't think that Professor Frimpong Boateng has anything he, to hide. He need I mean, role. that's the reality of the situation. You, 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 if you read the report, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's damning. Nobody could have made it's up that. Damning. I mean, all the incidents about I got a call yeah. and I had to go and do a repair or because they said the mining had affected. They didn't say mm -hmm. that, you know, Charlie, but, you know, the defense these days, so, well, uh, maybe my, my goal will come and help us with some is she proper here defense. <laughs> <laughs> but just quick, while we're going into Johnny's bites, but like Roland said, we're having a, a conversation about the movie industry. 
in Ghana. There are even concerns. And of course, if you check the website, Rosalind Ngiza had been nominated in one of the categories for Best Actress in, in you know, Comedy Series. For some reason, her name has disappeared. And we're asking questions. Was that a mistake? Will her name reappear? What exactly is going on? But even beyond that, mm. what are we not doing right? Because our movie mm. industry is literally dead, almost. I mean, of course, oh, cool, respect what to the literally, people who literally are... Literally means No, what? respect to the people who are doing great because we have Dede, we have all those other ones that Shelley from Pomance is producing. There's a new one the called one Madame on TV as well. So they're trying. So we can't say it's dead necessarily. But for some reason, we're not getting the attention. So we'll talk about that later today. Look forward to that conversation. Let's go into Johnny's Bites now.